The manufacturing process, which involves the winding and injection of resin, is highly automated. Industrial robots allow us to take optimal advantage of material characteristics and quality. Our main products are pressure vessels for air and liquefied petroleum gas, propane and butane. In this video, you will see fire tests performed with the LPG cylinder. This cylinder, as we shall see, does not explode in fire. First, a few words about the cylinder. The cylinder itself, including handles, weighs 9 kilograms. It has a capacity of 16 kilograms of propane. The leakage in our cylinder is comparable to that of a metal cylinder. During the tests, the cylinders are placed in a steel container on an elevated metal frame at a height of 200 millimeters. The temperature of the fire is approximately 1,100 degrees centigrade. This is achieved by igniting 20 liters of petrol in the container at each test. No safety devices, such as safety valves, are used. Approximately 90 seconds after the fire is set, the propane starts burning. It ignites as it streams out through small holes in the cylinder. When the temperature and pressure are high enough, the resin cracks and the gas seeps out. A stronger flame is seen when the material around the valve has burnt down. When the petrol has burnt out, a carbonized cylinder remains. This test has been performed with various amounts of propane in the cylinder, and the course of the fire has always been the same, not at all dramatic. Here, the upper cylinder is filled with 4.25 kilograms of propane, and the bottom cylinder contains 8.5 kilograms of propane. Two minutes after the gas from the bottom cylinder ignites, the gas seeping out of the upper bottle ignites. Three minutes later, the gas streaming out of the burnt down valve starts burning. After another three minutes, the bottom cylinder is ignited by flames from the upper cylinder. As you can see, a completely undramatic event. As we have seen, the cylinder does not explode, which is what we have intended to show with this film.